Yo, what's going on guys? Crispy Flakes here. For today's video, we have another birthday rebuild challenge. I know you guys love these. And be sure, guys, to let me know in the comment section below which uh, one of these stipulations is yours. So pretty much how this works is you are going to pick your birthday and month. And that is going to give you like the type of like NBA player you would be if you were in the NBA. So let's say you were born on March 31st. Well, guess what, man? You're DeMarcus Cousins of the Charlotte Hornets. So we all know he's a hothead. Or let's say you are on uh, December uh, 21st, then you are the next Derrick Rose on the Memphis Grizzlies. Or, let's just say, man, that you are October 24th. Then you are pretty much Crispy Flakes on his rec league basketball team. You are the bench warmer of the New Orleans Pelicans. Well, guys, my birthday is April 9th. So that makes me a future Hall of Famer. I'm the Phoenix... Phoenix Suns, man. Okay, well, maybe I'll be the new uh, round mound and rebound Charles Barkley. I'm, I'm pretty much already a round mound, so I got that going for me. Uh, now let's just hope I can get some rebounds, but here we go, guys. I made myself a Flake Griffin 96 overall, a future Hall of Famer. We are going to be doing a two-season rebuild, guys, to see if we can bring the Phoenix Suns back in two seasons as 96 overall player. Um, yeah, man, I, I'm, I'm a beast. I'm a beast, guys. I got that three-point shot. Call me Chef Crispy out there, or just call me Crispy. You don't got to call me... Uh, Chef Crispy. I'm thinking about though, Crispy is actually a pretty good basketball nickname. Like, if I ever make it to the NBA, so never, I, that'll be my nickname, name it, guys. Crispy Flakes. Um, so here we go, guys. This is what the lineup is looking like so far. We, I've done zero with this rebuild at all. Just have Flake Griffin on the roster here. Oh, so yeah, obviously, I'll be the starting point guard of this team. Me and Devin Booker are looking to be the new Splash Bullets out here, man. Like, we are going to be knocking, you know, Stephen Curry and Clay Thompson off that throw. We are taking over that nickname. We're taking everything, man. We got TJ Warren, who will probably get traded due to his bitch-ass contract. Although, being 24, and he's averaging, what was this? Yeah, I guess it's the last season, ain't it? So, that's not this uh, season stats. But look at his attributes here. Can't really shoot the three ball. No room for that, man. Because I'm trying to be a splash brother. I can't be having people sagging off TJ out here and screwing me over, man. Uh, we got Alan Williams. We got Alex Len. But pretty much, these two guys are sticking around, guys. Everybody else. It's probably going to get traded. I mean, I'm sure I'll keep Josh Jackson around. Probably will not be a starter for me, though, uh, right away. Just because, like, he's not quite there yet, it seems. But here we go. So, out of curiosity, man, uh, what y'all want for Flake Griffin? I, I just want to see who I would get traded for. So, uh, there's only one trade, and that would be Carl Anthony Towns and Andrew Wiggins. Also, keep in mind, guys, um, I, took, I, I took low contract money. The reason I did that is because I am a loyal player, guys. I am a loyal player. And can you imagine how many freaking Mac doubles I could buy from McDonald's for almost $800,000? Damn, dude, I'm all set. I'm going to be fat and happy crispy flakes up in here. Uh, also, my college, Central Michigan, that was my party college back in college. So, yeah, I didn't go there for college. I went to community. And then I went to a university, though. Got my uh, got my bachelor's in finance, believe it or not. Um, but, yeah, so I just want to tell you guys the information, I guess. Here we go, though. Let's get started on this. Uh, get going, get going. Okay, so definitely, and keep in mind, guys, for this rebuild, I'm not being realistic, man. Like, I'm going for the best team possible. I'm trying to bring this team back in two seasons. So, let's see what we can get with a trade of TJ Warren and also, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Brandon Nice still over here too, ain't he, man? He's still out here. No, just TJ Warren, maybe bitch-ass Monroe, toss in a uh, future first-round draft pick, see what that gets us. Come on, man, I'm trying to build that best team possible. So, uh, yo, TJ, I know we got a bitch-ass contract. Don't be freaking finessing me, 2K. I know this man got a bitch ass contract. Where's it at? There it is. Yeah, y'all trying to finesse me, man. Trying to hide that little extra money, man. That $105 million or whatever it is that he got. All right. Oh, yo, out of Porter. I'll actually take you on the team. Chris Milton, Tony Snell, not bad. Uh, Kevin Love, Jeff Green, DeAndre Jordan, eh, maybe. Uh, Tyreek Evans as small forward. I can see myself doing that and then trading away Trainer Parsons contract. Thinking about that, Sound Boy said that'd be a nice little pickup. Yo, we go Campbell Walker out here. Um, put myself as shooting guard. Put Devin Booker as small forward. That's something to think about, too. Like, that gives us an all-star point guard on this team. You know, I'm kind of feeling that, I think, guys. Because, like, realistically speaking, um, he does not cost that much money. Like, $12 million a season. I do like the idea of Clint Capella, but I'm also going to take on Ryan Anderson, Andre Drummond. I uh, love him, but not going to take him on my team for this video. Unless, I don't know, I probably won't. Uh, yeah, give me uh, give me Kemba Walker. I think I'm going to roll with that. Yes, we get Dwight Howard, who will be nice for his season. I'll probably trade him, like, in the offseason, though. Um, so yeah, so we get the rebound right there, and we'll do this. I'll put Flay Griffin as shooting guard. I go, ooh, damn, hell yeah, 98 overall player. Devin Booker, he goes down one rain point. That's not that big a deal. He's 6'6", can totally play small forward. Although, I don't think his defense is all that great. So, um, that's all good. It's all good. L. Williams, he's, I believe he can, like, stretch it out, can he? Like, he got, like, a uh, pretty good three ball. I could be completely <laughs> wrong. Give me that wrong, man. Donald Trump's out. Wrong. Yeah, not, not uh, dealing with that. 
Yo, give me a give me a small or a power forward that can shoot that basketball, man. Come on, everybody gotta be gone. Tyson Chandler, Alan Williams, future first round draft pick. Two of them. Two of Okay, guys, I can only do one. I'm getting too savage right now. Where we got JJ Reg, TJ McConnell, Miritich, uh, Bobby Portis, Jay Crowder, that's okay. John Collins, no, Frank Kaminsky. Uh, if it wasn't Marvin, I'd probably do that trade. Nice little stretch player. We got Ennis Cantor and Jared Jack. I know we got that player option lurking, but that's kind of okay. Um, not really loving any of these trades. Not gonna lie, guys. Not really loving any of these trades all that much. I mean, JJ Reddick for like off the bench would be okay for one season, I guess. Damn, dude, where are all the good power forwards at? I mean, Ennis Cantor. He got he got 84 mid-range shots, so I could actually stretch him out that four spot. Will he cost how much do you cost? Uh, can't shoot that three at all. I, I know you could. I know why I don't know why I even looked. Alright, I think I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with Ennis Cantor. Jared Jack is a backup. Probably trade Ennis in the offseason also, or keep him. I'm not really sure yet. But we will put him at that stretch four spot because he can shoot the mid range, so that's okay. Uh, so he goes 84 overall. That's that's decent. I can roll with that. So starting lineup was looking good this season, guys. As far as like money goes, um Yeah, I don't know how many bit chess contracts we actually got left here. Yo, let's check this out. Check them out. Alright, so yeah, our starting lineup got bitch ass contracts. Uh Jared Dogley. This dude looked like man the freaking like the guy at the YMCA that's trying to lose like 50 pounds but just never can, aka me. <laughs> aka me. Besides that though, it's like the bitch ass contract situation is not that bad. I wish I could take away this man's uh player option, but I'm sure I will get rid of him eventually unless we do some good things this season. So yeah, I definitely gotta get myself some more minutes out here. Um we ain't running on 11 man lineup. Please believe that ain't gonna happen. Okay, we got this. So we are gonna give myself some more minutes. Get myself, you know, about 48 a game. Uh, I, I can manage that. Devin Booker getting him about 32. 30 for Kemba Walker. You know what? More for Kemba. More for Devin Booker, too. I want this team balling out here, guys. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and simulate this season to see just how good this uh, Flake Griffin team can really do. I'm thinking, man, I can get that MVP and lead this team to at least 60 wins. Phoenix Suns Nation, I would like to apologize on behalf of Flake Griffin, the biggest bitch ass in the NBA, guys. I'm a 98 overall freaking choker out there. Fridge protector bitch ass. They can't even get a freaking playoff seed. God damn. Oh my god, guys. A record of 41 and 40? Are you serious, 2K? Or is the Suns just cursed? Simulate through day. How did my team do so bad? Yeah, I didn't I didn't get playoffs. I didn't even get MVP. I got oh my god. I'm oh my god. I'm gonna throw up. I'm a freaking rookie of the year. I'm rookie of the year, guys, but I got freaking 16 points, 9 rebounds, 11 assists. Where the scoring at, bitch, crispy? Oh my god, guys. I'm a 98 overall player, 2K. 98 overall player, man. And I'm leading my team to the freaking, I don't know. Not the glory land, that's for damn sure. Devin Booker leading scorer out here. Kem Walker, third. I mean, score-wise, our team did work, man. Like, we all put up, uh, you know, 10 points. We have six players averaging double digits is what I'm trying to get at here, man. But I was... I expected to score, man. I expected to be dropping about, man, 30, 40, 50, 60 points. And I'm 26. I'm an old man now, too. Oh, my God. Here we go, guys. Uh, yeah, I can't even say first round of the playoffs. Cause we ain't, there ain't no playoffs that first round up for us. All right. Simulate playoffs. Because we didn't make it. All right, yo. But there's going to be some freaking moves made this summer, guys. There's going to be some moves made. Crispy, you might be getting traded. <laughs> All right. So, we got the Warriors Cavaliers. It's like, a, it's like something out of a nightmare, guys. Cavaliers. Or we got the Warriors winning NBA championship. At least Kevin Durant did not get finals MVP. All right. Here we go, guys. Um, NBA draft, uh, I'm not going to worry too much about it because like, it's not going to be that great a pick anyway. Plus, I think we might trade our draft pick. But we do get on our team, Jaron Jackson Jr. with the 14th pick. So, definitely not bad there. I will sign him up. Team player options. Cantor declined his. Thank God. I really did not want him back all that much. Tyler Ulis, I'll bring him back. Or Ulis, however you say it. I always mess that name up. Qualifying offers. Alec Peters, no. Don't want you on my team. Free agency. Here we go. Here we go. All right, so we got to make things work here. Yo, uh, I know you a snake, Duran, but you want to come team up with old Crispy over here, man? We can make some noise. Sounds for that. Not really, but I, like, truly want all that much uh, for free agency. Like, I wanted a power forward, but there's just, like, not any great options. Um, so I'm thinking I might actually go for Ennis Cantor get him back. But at the same time, we didn't do nothing. Yo, how much you how much you cost, KD? All right, so I might be able to make this work. If I can trade find a way... Because the way Howard... Damn, he's 85 overall still? All right, how do I make this work? All right, yeah, if I can trade away Jared Dudley, I should be able to give uh, Durant a max contract. So let's see what I can get here. I just want a draft pick for the man. Hopefully that's offered to us. Uh, come on, come on. Here, what do we got? What do we got? All right, here we go. Here we go. Some uh, some draft picks from the Mavericks. I'll take that for sure. 
top three protected, that's okay. So I think that's enough to offer Durant a max counter now. Yes, it pretty much is, I think. Come on, come on, Durant. Don't be a snake for once in your life. Come help Crispy Flakes win this championship. We're going to give you a lot of money, too. And he went back for the Warriors. At least he was somewhat loyal in this case. But now we're kind of screwed as far as all this goes. Um, Melo. Would I rather have Melo or Ennis Cantor at this point? I mean, Ennis Cantor is rated higher. And, well, I don't know, but, but system player-wise, Carmelo's there. So I, I, I would put him at power forward. Um, but our defense is already lacking. So you know what, man? Not saying Ennis Cantor is like the greatest defender out there. But, you know, we try to get the best bank for our buck. He's the highest overall player left in free agency. So I'm going to give him the money here. Sign him up to the team. Um, what else we got here? I can get like a Jeff Green for the bench. Nurkic, maybe. Give him some money. Jeff Green. I'm just offering money to everybody now. Okay, I can't get him. Jeff Green can't get him. Julius Randle can't get him. That's right. I got to do this. Got to let go of some guys. All right. Now we might be able to. No, we cannot. No, we cannot. All right. Well, we'll get Ennis Cantor back at least. Um our money situation yeah negative five million so we ain't gonna be signing no players this season that's for damn sure any low lows out there how is i getting the low low guys gerald green 78 overall for three million come on man you actually you actually want to find time play play for the suns i believe so i'm gonna give you a nice little contract here come play for us be a backup all right got him all right guys i'm gonna go ahead and simulate to the beginning of the regular season Okay, so this is what the team was looking like, guys. Our same star line, Kemba, Flay, Griffin, Devin Booker, Ennis Cantor, and also Dwight Howard. We have Gerald Green, who is a 76 overall player. Uh, Josh Jackson is up to a 76 overall also. So we also got Ulysses, Troy Daniels, and Marquise Christ. Definitely going to be running a small ball lineup this season. So hopefully they can get things going on offense. Um, so yeah, guys, I guess without further ado, let's go ahead and submit this season. See if I can put up better numbers, man. I might have to look at my tendencies or something like that. I don't know what that is. But, uh, yeah, man, it's not looking good for us. But hopefully, Flay Griffin can finally lead this team to the promised land. Okay, so you guys know that Carl Malone is called the mailman. Well, you can call myself the trash man because I can't freaking... I'm just garbage, guys. I'm straight up garbage. I could not get us to a 50-win season, man, with Crispy Flakes out here. And I, I feel like if Flay Griffin was not on this team, I would be like, all right, this team needs a little bit more help a little bit quicker. I think I was just leaning too much on myself. So that's not great. We got Russell Westbrook getting the MVP out there. Michael Porter Jr., Rookie of the Year. Jeremy Lin, six man. Uh, Daniel Tice, most improved. Good for him. All-NBA first team, no crispy there. All-NBA second, no. So I did make the All-NBA third team as a 99 overall player at this point, uh, which still is not all that impressive if you ask me. But here we go. Player stats on the season. Uh, so this season, yes, yeah, scoring. Uh, guys, I even looked at my tendencies. I did. Like, I put my shot tendencies up, uh, my touches up. So I don't know if it's just, like, bad chemistry or just too many, like, shot plate people. <laughs> I don't even know the word, man. Shot creators or shot whatever on this team. I'll be, you know, 20.7 rebounds, 8 assists. You know, on paper, that's a pretty decent season. Not for a 9-9 overall player. Uh, Devin Booker, pretty good scoring season. Kemba Walker, 16 points. Got about 7 assists out there. And his canter. Still decent numbers for us. Double-double for uh, Dwight Howard over a block a game. So here we go. We do have playoffs. We're going to see how this goes. And not to mention, I also played 48 minutes. Um, First round, we do have the Timberwolves. Simulate current round. See how this goes. And, well, we subbed them four games to zero. So at least we got to the second round. Close out game, Flake Griffin. 29.7 rebounds, 11 assists. I'm 13 for 27 shooting. Uh, just call me Russell Westbrook, I guess. Right. Oh, yo, Portland. Yo, there we go. That's a GG, man. Dang, y'all got all uh, Ryan Anderson on this team. Wow, y'all knocked out the Warriors. Similar current rounds. And beat Portland four games. Okay, so we are in the Western Conference Finals at least. Uh, scoring, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven players getting double digits that game. All right, and we have the uh, Houston Rockets who knocked out the OKC Thunder. Similar current round here. And, well, we lost four games to one in the Western Conference Finals. Definitely not bad. But I will say, the numbers I put up this season, I would not give myself no uh, legendary future Hall of Famer out there. Anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this video. This was a ton of fun to do. If you ever come across these type of challenges, send them to me on Twitter, guys. At Flakes 2 k Thank you all so much for watching, and peace out, my friend.